We will always remember a solemn promise made by volunteers every year as they lay wreaths at the headstones of our fallen heroes. Ken's Five's Jessica Coombs shows us how wreaths across America is keeping their memories alive. God needed the angel that we had. Judy Carlisle's husband Jim is one of thousands laid to rest in military USA. His service echoing the sacrifices made every day by those protecting our freedoms. It's not just about Jim. It's about every single person that's laid to rest beside him. Fort Sam Houston is one of more than 3,400 cemeteries around the U.S. that joins wreaths across America to honor our fallen veterans. Volunteers say it's also an opportunity to teach the next generation to never forget. Because they need to know, remember, and take the time to teach the children and the community about a price of freedom because it's not free. Well, as you can see, <laughs> I'm blessed and I feel glad to be home. William J. Miller says those who do come home carry the weight of what they experienced. We have no idea what our men and women see. Some of them can take it. Some of them have issues and not be able to make it through like others. Suicide is the second leading cause of death for post 9-11 veterans. We so need not to have 22 losses a day of veterans that can't just can't deal with life after they come back because it's so, so difficult. We need to stop that. We've got to be there for them. Reporting on the Northeast Side, Jessica Coombs, Ken's Five.